America's broken immigration policy is more than failed politics. It is a human tragedy affecting our most vulnerable brothers and sisters. Deep within every religious tradition is the story of Exodus. It's a theme familiar to every religious leader, but one for which few are prepared to lead. Real understanding requires more than a knowledge of scripture or theology. And that's why the Seminary Consortium for Urban Pastoral Education led a three-day immersion experience for faith leaders. Crossing the border into Nogales, Mexico, nearly a dozen pastors, professors, students, and lay leaders met with the activists, authors, and most importantly, immigrants, who live with, and sometimes die from, the struggle for a better life. The immersion process began by meeting with author Peg Bowden, to get the real story of immigration's punishing realities. Are exhausted, they're disheveled. Uh, policies have killed people and have separated families, and, and that's really the bottom line. Next, the group teamed with the Kino Border Initiative, a ministry of the Catholic Church. We offer humanitarian aid to migrants, two meals a day in what we call the comedon, which means dining room in Spanish. We have a women's shelter for deported women, and then we offer first aid. We have educational programs on the U.S. and Mexican side, including immersion groups that come in and visit us to understand the reality of the individuals that we serve. When we host immersion experiences, we really have three goals. Uh, one is to humanize. We often talk about immigration in the abstract. What does it mean to meet individuals and hear their stories directly from them? We're not controlling the narrative. The second is to accompany. What does it look like to journey with migrants on the day of their lives? And the third is to complicate. Sometimes we tend towards simple answers. The goal here is to leave with more questions than we came with. And here are the resources from my scripture. Finally, the group engaged in a process of forming a contextual theology, building a foundation for faith-based leadership in their respective arenas of ministry. Is to faithing, not to believing. In just three days, the consortium's immersion challenged, trained, and equipped faith leaders with the tools to address one of the most overwhelming tragedies of our time. The power of immersion is transformative. It engages the head, heart, and hands in faith-powered, action-centered strategy. It is ministry that cuts across the barriers of politics, culture, and class, it is the fulfillment of God's promise of a land, a home, a new life.